Hey everybody, I've, uh, I was looking online and I saw that uh, some people were teaching, you know, CPR and uh, life-saving things like that, but uh, they didn't quite have the technique down right. So I'm going to go over a few of those things with you here today. So uh, here's the scenario. We came upon this patient. He's, uh, he's lying on the ground. Uh, we don't know what happened, so we're going to approach him. Excuse me, sir. Um... Are you okay? Are you okay? Hello? Okay. So we're not getting anything out of him. Uh, he also seems to be missing his eyeballs. So we're going to look around and uh, assess the scene, make sure that there's nothing that could be causing this. I mean, maybe he's... Oh! We found a baby. Okay. So we'll go ahead. And... Oh my god! Uh, we'll ask him about the baby. Excuse me, sir. Is... Is this your baby? Sir. Again, nothing. So we'll go ahead and, uh, well, I believe that you're supposed to have skin-to-skin -skin contact on a newborn baby. So we'll go ahead and place the baby next to him there. Um, actually, you know what? Let's, let's, let's go ahead and... Uh, there we go. All right. Now, uh, we're going to go ahead and begin compressions. Uh, somewhere... Okay, so he has no legs also. Uh, sir, do you even want me to do compressions? Because it doesn't look like you got a whole lot to live for. You have no legs. You've got a smoking dead baby next to you. And I just found your toddler in a bag in your home. So the police are going to come here. Do you want me to bother or just, just let you go? I don't know what to do with this guy. Anyways, so you start compressions here. We'll go here. Oh, that's not right. I, I'm gonna. Oh, oh. Nothing. So. Oh, I got it. I got it. We'll put the defibrillator on. That ought to help. I think I'm, I'm just going to go roll out some hose or something. I don't know what to do. But uh, anyways, I'll uh, I'll let you know how this turns out here. But it's, it's not looking good. Like serial killer. I don't even know where the mother is, to be completely honest. Or he could be the mother. It's no legs, no genitals. He could be a she. Thank you for your time.